Hi everyone, That Cat Mommy here, and today I'm gonna to show you some of the most adorable Christmas items that I got for my boys to celebrate Christmas. I love to buy them holiday-themed toys. Um, I'm gonna link where you can get all these toys in the description of this video if you're interested in getting them for your cats. Honestly, right now, I know where a few of them came from, but I'm not sure where every single one of them came from. So we'll have to link them in the description, but I wanted to get out and show you guys because I thought some of these might have really good Black Friday sales on them. Uh, I'm not sure because they're from all over different companies, but they might. So the first item I wanna show you guys is this. I do know this came from Chewy.com. It is a cat advent calendar. Now it has all kinds of different toys in it. This one is currently sold out on Chewy.com. I don't know if they're gonna get any more in. I will say this, while it's adorable and the toys are okay, um, I don't know that my cats are really actually going to enjoy any of these toys, maybe like, maybe like this one, maybe like one or two of them. Uh, but I really wanted them to have an advent calendar. I thought this was cute. Um, since I bought this and I actually got my hands on it, I'm not mad about the price I paid on it because it is such a good quality construction that I will use this probably again next year, even though I don't like, this is just a stuffed toy, which like my cats aren't, into stuffed toys <laughs> like i'm sure they'll be cute for a picture now they might like this ball um maybe but i wasn't mad about it because it is made so well that i can use this again and i can basically next year just fill this up with toys that i know that my cat is going to actually like and ta-da i fixed the problem so i don't know that i would advocate buying this but what I do think is cool since we love advent calendars um, they're just always exciting for something new to do we really wanted one for our boys so that's why I bought this one now having said that I think if I had to go back and do it all over again um, it's I, I prefer blue holiday decorations and this is red and green so I would probably do something like a wooden advent calendar or any advent calendar that is empty that you could put stuff in and more than likely that's what we'll end up doing next year and we'll do like treats as opposed to like toys or maybe a mixture of toys and treats but you guys know your cats best you know what they're going to love so i'm going to link <clears throat> in the description box some really cool advent calendars that you can use as cat advent calendars um, ones that i would probably buy if i had to do it <laughs> all over again but if it does come back in stock um, i'll link to this as well on Chewy.com so you guys can check that out. Um, just a heads up, the links, some of these links in the description box, some of them, not all of them, are my affiliate links, which means I make a little bit of commission on it, like not a lot. I'm not living large on the commission that I make on it, for sure. Um, but I just wanna be open and transparent. I don't recommend items, I'm very honest with you guys, that's just who I am with what I like and what I use, and I don't promote anything that I don't believe in, um, or that I don't know that my cats are gonna kinda like. So this is from Target. These are holiday mousers. I buy them holiday mice every single holiday. Sometimes they get excited, or like we bought these for Halloween. <laughs> we buy these for like, if they, if Target, we buy them in the summertime. Like when Target ever puts out their mousers, we buy them. We have so many mousers. Um, and they don't love these. They will occasionally play with them, but I love to use them for decor or just to, to put them around and leave them sit in different places. Sometimes I'll, I'll play games where I put all their little mouses out and I'll hide treats under them. And normally the only ones that, I hide treats under are the new ones, you know, so they just kind of get to interact. So um, if your cats do love little plush uh, mousers with, and, and they like this tail that a lot, um, this little corded tail. Um, I don't know if it's the way it moves or what, they really like that, but Target has their new ones out and I'll link to that in the description, but I thought these were adorable. We use these a lot for pictures as well, um, just cause they're so cute. And I play a little game where if you guys follow me on my Instagram account, where uh, with these holiday mice, I see how many I can stack on them before they get mad and knock them off. So I'm like stack it like on their head and on their on their back, <laughs> just play little games with them. So uh, I wanted to bring these in there because again, it's one of my, my favorite things to give the babies. Um, this is adorable. I don't know where it's from, but I will link it in the description, but it's cold, <laughs> like they're bad. And it's two little 
black fluffy pieces of coal, which I think they're going to love these. They are plush, but they're more like round. So I think they will chase them and, and I'm excited to see what they do with them. But again, I thought this was adorable. And if nothing else, um, again, we use cat toys as, as holiday decorations because we have cats. And if you do uh, decorate your house, <laughs> I would say find cute cat toys to decorate them with that way, as much as possible. That way you don't have to worry about like my cat can't touch that decoration or I have to keep my cat away from that decoration. Like we don't have um, really any decorations that they can get anywhere near that we would be worried about them interacting with. So uh, we do like to decorate uh, with cat toys as much as possible. And this next one, this is a three pack of these. Um, these I believe are um, catnip. They have catnip in them, but they also are plush. So they're not 100% stuffed with catnip. I think they smell catnippy, but that might just be because they've been in with catnip. But again, I thought this was a cute holiday decor item. They might like to chew on it. We have pretty big boys. They're not Maine Coons, but they are um, 15 pounders. So they're, they're pretty big, but I thought these would be cute. Again, you can use them as a decoration if your kitties don't like to play with them, but we'll see. And again, you guys can check out my Instagram account. I'm going to be cat testing all of these over there so you can see if it's a yay or an A, if it's a cute item or decor. And we save all of our cat toys. If they don't tear them apart, we save all of these and we just kind of build little decoration uh, creation. So something else you can do. And I'm sure I've seen really people get really super crafty with these and even like do wreaths and stuff that are entirely made out of cat toys, which I think cute, cute other thing. Now these items, I know my cats are going to love. I know they're going to love. Um, I, as soon as they see me take them out of the bag, they, they can like smell it in the air and they get super excited about it. So this is the Yowie Christmas crinkle toy. And I'll link to it in the, the description too. So I was trying to show you guys. It does crinkle a little bit, which is fun because they like the crinkle sound. Oh, he just left. I was like, let me see if he'll play with it. But he just rolled out. Um, but they do like the crinkle sound. But this is packed. It's so stiff. Like you can see the reason why is it's packed with catnip. Yowie toys come with a little bit more price tag than like something like this, but they're huge and they're packed with a crap ton of catnip and cats go crazy over Yowie toys. Every single Yowie toy I bought my cats, they flipped out about. So this one was really cool. Um, as soon as I pulled it out of the package, I have let them play with this one. They were both all over it, just rolling around and rubbing their face in it and rolling all over it. So they really enjoyed this one and again it has the crinkle aspect of it too one of my cats is a crinkle fan the other one not so much um but the one that loved the crinkle loved it and then it's soft on the back it's got this soft on the back so they can lay on it and they do snuggle the one toys they do snuggle with they snuggle with yaoi toys like they're not gonna snow i know they're not gonna snuggle with this they're just not that type of baby but um yaoi they lay on them all the time it's crazy and then of course we bought them this it's also another Yowie, and it is just a little stocking. This is a little bit smaller, but <laughs> just blew a fuzz up my nose. <laughs> the thing about Yowies is you can smell this. Like, I can smell this immediately, and so I know my cats can smell this coming out of the bag, but this is a cute little stocking. It's definitely smaller. It's not as big in comparison to my head, just to show you guys. It's pretty big. This is not as big. So this might be better for a kitten. This would be awfully big, I would think, for a kitten. And then the last holiday toy item. And these are all items that I give to my cats before Christmas. Like I said, we decorate with them. Um, we stick to more things like beds and um, like treats and stuff like that for actual Christmas gifts or holiday gifts, depending on what you celebrate. Um, but we like to give them their Christmas toys before so they can play with them. So this is the last one. This is the big boy. This thing is literally bigger than my head. 
It's for real. That's my chin. That's my top of my head. Um, it is the Yowie Christmas cane. Again, this is packed with so much catnip. It is pretty big. Um, I don't know how a kitten would deal with this. I think that would be hilarious though. Um, but my boys are going to love it. They love the bigger cat toys because they can get their whole body on them and really kick kick at this bottom part. They really like to kick it um, and, then, and then chew on it at the same time. So this is another item I definitely recommend for your kitties this holiday season. So again, check out the description box for uh, these, the links to get any of these if you guys want to check them out for your fur babies. I do recommend these toys. I will show you guys. They come in Ziploc bags. You need to put these somewhere your cats can't get to them because they can smell them from a mile away, unless you want to just directly hand it to them, they can smell them from a mile away and they will go to extreme lengths to try to get to these. Um, so just as a forewarning on that. <clears throat> so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a like. If you want more cool videos from me, make sure you hit the bell and subscribe to my channel. And until I see you guys over on the next video, which I will be talking about my favorite items to give your kitties for the holidays, not just holiday toys, which come early, but actual presents or presents as we call them in my house. Um, make sure you subscribe and until I see you guys next time, remember to keep living your most perfect life.